What's up guys? Chase fan number nine here. And I got some interesting silly season news from the Xfinity Series camp, specifically from Richard Childress Racing. They have announced that Myatt Snyder and Tex Slayer are joining them in 2020 for a part-time schedule. And this is pretty cool. So happy they're bringing back Myatt Snyder to NASCAR's top well to their one of their top three series because i feel like snyder has the potential i mean he did okay with kbm and trucks and he drove for thor sport last year and um after last year he basically i guess you can say he got kicked to the curb basically and he only ran a few races the last time we saw him was was at Gateway when he was driving for a suspended Johnny Sauter. So I'm glad they're bringing him back. But to Xfinity this time, excuse me. And I don't think he's ran an Xfinity race yet in his career. So this is a good start for him. Um, Let's see. He does have some top fives with both um, KBM and um, Richard and um, Thor Sport. So that tells you he's got potential. So it says here, up and coming NASCAR star Mike Snyder will join Richard Childress racing in the NASCAR Xfinity Series in 2020 with support from Tax Slayer, a leading online professional tax preparation and financial company. Snyder and Tax Slayer will make select starts with RCR beginning with the 2020 season opener at Daytona on February 15th, which is a Saturday. Tax Slayer is a family owned, operated, and operated company focused on providing customers with a mo with a remarkable tax filing experience. Uh, over 50 years ago in Augusta, Georgia, TaxLayer has evolved into an innovative tax preparation and financial technology company that retains its founder's commitment to its employees, customers, and community. We are proud to join the RCR family of corporate partners and align ourselves with a driver as talented as and accomplishes Mike Snyder said Tax Slayer President Tax Slayer President and CEO Brian Rhodes. RCR and Snyder will RCR and Snyder are helping us share the Tax Slayer story with race fans so more people can file their taxes quickly and afford affordably. We couldn't be more excited to see them through to the finish line. It says here Snyder, an accomplished driver who, whose resume includes 2018. Oh yeah, I remember in 2018 he was Truck Series Rookie of the Year. So that shows you some. He joins an impressive list of drivers who have competed in the NASCAR Xfinity Series under the RCR banner, including Harvick, Voyer, the Dillon brothers, Hemrick and Reddick, among others. Snyder then said, I'm thrilled to be driving for RCR in 2020, he said. It's an honor to drive for a team with such a rich history in the sport, and I'm excited to start learning from everyone. After a great season of racing in Europe this past year, I'm excited to be back home and moving up to the NASCAR Xfinity Series. I'm also happy Tex Slayer has returned for another year to support my racing career, continued Snyder. I'm honored to be part of bringing them back to the Xfinity Series, Tax Slayer has been a loyal partner of mine, and I can't wait to see what we can build together moving forward. I know the season just ended, but 2020 is shaping up to be an excellent year. I'm just ready for Daytona to get here as soon as possible. Yeah, um, last year, um, Snyder competed in the NASCAR Whelan Euro Series, where he finished fifth in the season-long championship standing, so that sh shows you he uh, has talent. The, the Nave also made select starts in 2019 and is also a former winner in the Arkham Menard Series with a win at Toledo Speedway in 2016, in which it was his first ever Arca start. Richard Childress then said, We're proud to be joined forces with Maya and Tex Slayer during the 2020 season. He said, Both Maya and Tex Slayer are family focused, with Maya's family being involved in racing and Tex Slayer being a family-owned tax and financial technology company. Those values fit perfectly with ours, and I think will help guide 
all of us to on and off track success next season. So that should, um, I'm pretty thrilled. I can't wait to see what Mike Snyder does. They haven't said what car number yet. I'm assuming he'll either drive the two or the 21 car. So that's what I believe. If he drives the two or 21, either car is fine. Even though I do want to see the 21 car again on track. And also to mention, um, Mike Snyder is the son of pit reporter Marty Snyder. So do you see the connection there? It took me until this year to figure that out. So yeah, I'm I'm pretty excited about this. Um, I hope um, Snyder can do something. If I had to predict now, he'll probably get a couple top fives. And he'll also probably get maybe at least one win. One win. So... Yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. Yeah. And also, not to mention, the last time we saw Tax Slayer in the sport was when they were with Junior Motorsports. Remember those paint schemes that the 7 and 88 car ran? That was Tax Slayer. So, yeah, that's pretty much all I gotta say. Well, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the bell down below to get notifications for all my videos. Make sure to hit that like button. And also, I will put a link in the description that will take you to that article that I just read. And with that, I'll see you guys all in the next video. And with that, this has been Chase Fan number 9, and I'll see you guys soon. Alright, bye guys.